Chris and he is going to demonstrate how we make a summer vegetable risotto step by step so that we can follow the recipe. Hi Chris. Hi. Right, we've got one small um, red onion and a clove of garlic that's ready chopped, nice and fine. Courgette, we'll use about half of that for the allotment. A couple of fresh mulla beans and a bunch of asparagus. We've got fresh thyme, parsley, red basil and sweet margarine. So we're going to use half, this, half the courgettes. Just chop that and tail it. We'll cut it length ways. Given that it's nice and thin, we'll cut some the same size as the courgettes and beans to go into the, the rice, and the rest we'll just char grill in a, in a pan to finish on top. First of all, we're going to add a touch of, we're using rapeseed oil, but you could use sunflower oil or olive oil. This should serve too. Small red onion and a clove of garlic. We're just going to cook off slightly first before we add our rice. Approximately 175 to 200, well, that will serve two people. We're just going to cook this off a little bit without colouring it. We still don't want to go any old garlic taste at the end. Now we're going to add our rice. We cook that for another couple of minutes. Alborio rice, which is thick and it's more, more starchy than the long grain rice you'd use for if you're making a curry or something like that. Now the rice is, is covered and it's sealed with the, with the oil. We're going to slowly start adding the vegetable stock. We've got eight, 800 millilitres here and we've used a couple of vegetable stock cubes. Help the rice to release all the starches and give it this nice texture. So we'll keep cooking it like this for about a gentle heat for about 10 minutes. As you can see, the rice has taken up nearly all the liquid now. And so, what we're going to do, we're going to add our, our cut vegetables to it. the asparagus and the, the runner beans and also now we're going to add a bit more, a bit more stock. Right, so the vegetables have all gone in, the stone we've added more stock, they're going to take about seven to ten minutes to, to cook through this way, by which time we'll have added would have taken up the rest of the stock I'm adding now. Stirring all the time. Mixed herbs and we taste it the seasoning, which is just right. In this pan here, we've got the asparagus tip, just a little bit of oil, and then we're going to have just a little bit of butter just to give it a nice, nice creamy texture. Serve, serve three, 